Hey guys, uh, I'm back with another Octopod video. Today, since it's around Christmas time, I decided to treat myself to some <coughs> Calling the Grinch at 3am videos. So we're going to go over some of them today, and you won't be surprised that most of them are by NNA Productions. In case you are unfamiliar with their channel, they pretty much make videos of them calling fictional characters from various movies, and then them supposedly coming to their house when in actuality it's just some stuffed animal or cardboard cutout of said character. The video we're going to be watching today is Do Not Order the Grinch Happy Meal at 3 a.m. Asterisk, OMG, he came to my house, asterisk. And it's pretty much what you would expect. Now it is time to watch this film sure. that I'm pretty sure will be a masterpiece. Guys, if I think this is a spider fidget spinner on Spider-Man's head, for five seconds, you guys have to smash the like button. Okay, first of all, why does he think that fidget spinners are still relevant? They're not. What does Spider-Man have to do with the Grinch? It, it has no relevance there. And third off, I don't have to smash the like button. There's no, there's not going to be anyone, like, at forcing me at gunpoint to like a YouTube video. That's not how it works. Wanna join my free gift cards giveaway? Subscribe to my channel, like the video, and turn notifications on. And finally, tell me on the comment section that you subscribe. Wait just a minute there. I recognize that line. Wanna join my free gift card giveaway? And subscribe to my channel, like the video, and turn notifications on. And finally, tell me in the comment section. Derv and NNA Productions are the same person confirmed. There is no other evidence needed. They said the same lines, showed the same pictures, and used the same general generic music. Wanna, Wanna join, join my, my free gift, gift card giveaway? Subscribe, subscribe to my, my channel, channel, like the, the video, video, and, and turn, turn notifications on. on. And finally, and finally, tell me, on the tell me in the comment section below. Why does NNA Productions sound like he's doing ASMR? Maybe because he has so many noise complaints from screaming Thanos at 3am that he has to whisper now. Thanos! I really hate to be the one to break this news to all of you, but these gift card giveaways are not real. They never have announced a winner. It's just bait for you to subscribe. Yeah, just don't participate in gift card giveaways. That's the lesson here. Alright, so now we're going to actually look at the part where he supposedly orders a Grinch Happy Meal at 3 o'clock in the morning, and the Grinch supposedly goes over to his house and does something with him. He said that, wait, let me just call the Grinch and ask him if he can deliver me the Grinch Happy Meal, alright guys? It's gonna be like so insane. Like, I'm just gonna call Grinch at 3 a.m. and ask him if he can deliver me the Grinch Happy Meal, alright guys? It's gonna be like so insane. Well, I mean, are you going to do it or not? For the last 20 minutes, all you've been doing is talking about it and not actually doing the thing that you're talking about, which is, I mean, what you're supposed to do, right? guys it is 3 22 a.m right now and i just got the grinch number on my phone right now and boom calling guys guys look at this i even saved the name as grinch guys yo i'm just gonna ask him if he can deliver me the grinch happy meal come on yo it's gonna be insane guys come on oh my god yo guys he hanged up yo that means the phone is actually Whoa, he hung up on me? That obviously means it's the real Grinch. Because it, hanging up on people obviously means that you are the person who they are trying to reach. Also, you may notice that he says guys and yo way too much. I'll just point that out now because it'll probably bother everyone for the rest of the video. Also, that little dance montage, I didn't add that in or anything. That was actually part of the video. So he decided to fill more time to push the video over to 10 minutes by dabbing for 3 minutes. That's pretty smart. I mean, at least it's not completely clickbait. He did call the person in his contacts named the Grinch, but the Grinch doesn't pick up until about three and a half minutes into the video. All right, now for the part where the Grinch actually picks up, and they have an in-depth conversation for about 30 seconds or so. Come on, please. Come on, come on, come on, please. Yo, this is going to be insane if you answer, guys. Like, I'm, I'm just going to say, can you send me the Happy Meal? That's it. 
Come on. And if he sends it to me. No. Hello, what's this? I'm in the trench. What do you want? Oh my god, are you really the Grinch? I told you, I'm the Grinch. What do you want? Uh, is it possible if you send me the Grinch Happy Meal, your Happy Meal? I don't have the Grinch Happy Meal. But I will get it for you. See you soon. Wait, you don't have my address yet. I think I already got it. <laughs> Alright, first of all, it does not sound like the Grinch at all. Second of all, why is there an echo? Maybe he voiced over or something? Maybe he made the sound a bit louder? Also, there are a lot of massive pauses in between his words. Why, like, why does it take the Grinch 20 seconds to respond to something? I don't think there's that much of a delay from the call. That's not really how modern technology functions. You're gonna have, at most, maybe a two or three second delay. Alright, now let's time travel into the future to the part where he receives the Grinch Happy Meal from the Grinch, who personally delivers it, because they definitely have time for that. Yo, what if it's actually the Grinch guy? Yo, come on, let's go. Come on. Oh my god! You guys! Wait, 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 wait. Look! Oh my god, it's the Grinch! Yo, there is no way! It is actually the Grinch, guys! Come on, let's open the door! I really like he's addressing this, like it's a teamwork situation. Like you have some input on what actually happens. Like if you smash the like button, he will actually appear. But no, it's just him filming him and his friend just playing around with a cardboard cutout of the Grinch. And also, you know it's the actual Grinch when he rep and when he retains the exact same facial expression throughout the entire thing and refuses to show the rest of his body. Also, why did it just go completely pitch black during part of the scene? Was that really necessary? Like, you could have turned on a light or s at least had a flashlight or something, but no. Alright, you really want to see the, ne the next part of that, right? The part where he actually receives the Happy Meal and then begins to do whatever he wanted to do with the Happy Meal. Maybe eat it. Well, if he wanted a Happy Meal, he probably could have just driven to McDonald's by himself. Actually, no, six-year-olds don't have access to cars. They have access to power wheels, but they don't have access to, like, a full car or anything. So, maybe it's good that he's getting a grown man to deliver him. Well, the Grinch isn't even a man. The, he's getting a green thing to bring him food, when in actuality he probably could have just called a family member to have them deliver something. Alright, here's the rest of the scene. Sorry for rambling about that. Oh my god, wait, oh, come on, yes, got it, oh my god, I'm scared, yo, Grinch, oh my god, he got the happy meal. First of all, why does he have so much difficulty opening a door? It's a door, it's not like getting the crown, saving the town and Mr. Krabs or anything. Also, why is it? that he's so surprised that the Grinch actually did the thing he had asked him to do. When you ask someone to do something varying from situation to situation, chances are they're gonna do it. I know what you're gonna wonder. What comes in the Happy Meal? Is there like a Tenos fidget spinner or something? Tenos? Could it be, I don't know, a bomb or anything? Well, we're about to find out, if he even opens it. He could just say, if you smash the like button enough, then I'll open it in the next video. But, who knows. Hi, Grinch! Oh my god, look at it, it's actually Grinch! Yo, where did he go? Oh my god. Yo, how did you get there, Grinch? Look guys, there's like no way. Grinch brought me the Happy Meal as well. Look at the Happy Meal box. Grinch, can I please have the Happy Meal? You may notice all these jump cuts. Uh, I'm not making them. He decided to just put jump cuts everywhere in the video. Also, apparently the Grinch has teleportation powers because he can move like 20 feet a second because he just teleported behind the corner. And also, why did he act like he had no idea where he went when he went behind the corner? You never would know that he is behind the corner when you literally just saw him go behind the corner.
Right, I'm done looking at the big chase scene. I'm gonna go to the part where he actually interacts with the Happy Meal and actually gets it from the Grinch, who just won't give him the Happy Meal. Grinch, Grinch, stop it right there. Just give me the Happy Meal, come on. Come on. Let me take the Happy Meal, Grinch. Thank you, Grinch. Well, what do you know, after like, 10 minutes, he actually gets the Happy Meal. Now I know what you're all thinking. What the flip could possibly be within the Happy Meal? Well, let me go through the video and see what is in the Happy Meal. Oh, the funny thing is it's green, guys. Like, it looks so dope. Come on, let's open it. Wait, it doesn't open. Come on, I got it. Yo, I'm scared to open it, guys. Come on. It doesn't open. Come on. Come on. Yes. Oh my god, I'm scared to open it. Come on. Wait. What is that? What is that, guys? Wait, what is this? Oh my god, I think it's green hair, guys. Yo. There is no way, guys. The Grinch just sent me his hair. His hair pieces. It is actually the Grinch hair. Yo. The Grinch. Look, guys. It's Grinch hair. Look at this. Look at his hair. It's Grinch's hair. Oh, my God. I'm just going to throw this Happy Meal out. Okay, so the thing that was in the Happy Meal that he worked very, very hard to achieve is hair. And he's just going to throw it out. Like, you get a DNA sample from a mythological creature, and instead of using it towards science or anything, you're just gonna throw it out. Okay. Also, if you would notice, uh, the Grinch hair on the box is significantly lighter than the Grinch hair he got, so I don't know what's up with that. You also may notice he's not addressing this in a good or bad situation style. He's just addressing it like, oh, Grinch hair. Okay. Like, he has no real- he really doesn't have a reaction to this. He's just showing you guys what it is without giving his input on it. Also, I just noticed this now. The- the grass looks kind of like crayon shavings. Like, when your crayon wouldn't work anymore, so you had to peel off the wrapping, and then you would just take the wrapping and just put it on the table or something. That's kind of what it reminds me of, just- because it's a, just a bunch of thin strips of paper. I had finished watching the video and it has a very unpredictable anime plot twist at the end. Just just take a look here. So make sure to give that big thumbs up if you enjoyed. Oh my god. Grinch. Yo. Look guys, this is the Grinch. 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 Where are you? Grinch. Come, let's just talk Grinch. Grinch. The Grinch! I'm going to steal the Christmas, and then I'm going to eat the Christmas. That was probably the most unexpected anime plot twist one would ever witness in the entirety of their lifetime. I mean, hands down, the Grinch appeared once more at the end of the video, but you thought he ran away from this guy for harassing him and repeatedly asking him for the Happy Meal that he had forced him to bring him. Alright, so I'm gonna end the video here. I'll leave you with the rest of the gameplay. But, um, yeah, I hope you guys had a Merry Christmas. Uh, I'm just gonna speed up the gameplay so it's under 15 minutes because I can't upload videos over 15 minutes yet.